Hey friends, it's that time of month again. No, not that time. Essential oils class time. And that's happening on Thursday. It's at Mojo Fit Studios. It's usually on a Thursday at 7 p.m., one of the Thursdays during the month. And this month, it's on the 22nd of December. And I'm going straight from this book because this is the book that uh, that has the program in it and gives you a ton of stuff. So if you're interested in this book, I'm actually going to leave a link to where to get it. It's, you can find it on Amazon. You can find it a lot of other places, but I'll link where to get it because it, it has a really good setup. It's month by month and it gives you a theme. It gives you the oils to use. Okay, it doesn't give you the oils. It just tells you what oils to use. Um, you can order them and then it gives you a class layout, how to use the oils, and it's amazing. And let me just start by saying that I am not an expert at essential oils. I am not a doctor. I am not, I'm not a professional at this. I'm learning about essential oils very slowly through this book because each month we use five or six of them. And then, so I do a little study, a little research on each of them, and then I share them with you guys. And these oils sometimes are doTERRA through the, the company doTERRA. Um, they're a little bit different than many of the other oils. And again, I'm not an expert, so I don't know everything about everything. What I will recommend if you want to know a little bit more about essential oils is I follow, follow this dude on Facebook. His name is Dr. Josh Axe, A-X-E. I would highly recommend following him because he does a ton of like live broadcasts and videos about essential oils and he knows a lot of stuff about a lot of stuff. I would say he is an expert. But besides that, I just want to dive right into getting into the content of what we're doing on Thursday. So Thursday will come and it's an unheated class at Mojo. It's pretty gentle. So everyone and anyone is welcome. And each month is a theme. This month is compassion. What does that mean? So we're just trying to cultivate kindness, both to ourselves and the world around us. And that's just kind of what December and the holiday season brings. And so I'm just gonna read this to you and what's about. Holidays are often a time when our cups become so full that there's little room for anything new. Yoga and essential oils can be a powerful catalyst for emptying our cup to make room to receive. This dynamic hip opening sequence is combined with seasonal essential oils to make room to receive the many gifts of the season, including self-care and compassion. Frankincense, white fur, and thyme essential oils help cultivate compassion. The uplifting and calming properties of wild orange in final relaxation will remind one of the importance of taking the time to be with oneself in a loving way. How nice is that? So yes, we are using a holiday joy blend, peppermint, frankincense, white fur, thyme, and wild orange. The quote here says, you have a solemn obligation to take care of yourself because you never know when the world will need you. And then the next page, it tells us how to use them. doTERRA oils are the only ones, probably oil, only oils out there that some of them are recommended and totally safe to put in your water to drink. And there's only a few oils like that. We're, this month we're using peppermint in our water. It's totally optional. You don't have to use it, but you can. And um, other months we use orange and lemon. So it's, it's, mo it's ones that just add a little bit of flavor, a little bit of zest to your water. And recommended don't use a plastic container just because it just breaks it down. Just don't do it. Use glass or, or like the stainless steel ones. Um, we're diffusing our holiday, holiday joy blend, which helps comfort and soothe emotional well-being, helps reduce airborne pathogens. Um, peppermint is very detoxifying and it's also uplifting. We're using frankincense on the bottom of the feet during child's pose at the very beginning. And then we use a white fur to um, in, the, in the middle towards like a tree pose, a balance pose, because it helps reduce aches, aches and pains and colds and flus, helps create a feeling of groundedness. Let's see, then we're using thyme. And this is really the first time I'm looking at this. We're using thyme in lotus pose, seated baby cradle. I'm not sure what those poses are. I'll have to look them up. It's kind of weird. Um, they also have like a sequence right here that I can use if I want to. And oftentimes I do kind of follow it. Not, not for sure though. Because in this it says to, to do dragonfly arm balance. 
and the audience going to this class, I'm not sure that we're doing a ton of arm balances or we'll have the space to do it. Our, our class is pretty full, but um, we'll see about that. And then at the very end, we're using Wild Orange in Final Meditation. It um, supports a positive mood and healthy digestion. So lots of good things. A lot of a lot of these are just oils that help you to receive, to forgive. Like there's both physical and emotional benefits to each one of these, and um, most of them are applied like topical onto your skin. And there's two different kinds of application for topical. You could do just the pure version of the oil, and that's fine. Most of them are okay. They do say if you need need them to be in a carrier oil. Some of the oils are like a little spicier or maybe you want them to spread and span over more of your body. So it's then they would be put into like a fraction, fractionated coconut oil, which is like unscented oil that you're able to more rub all over you. Whereas the pure versions, are they're highly concentrated so you only need a couple drops. Both of them, mostly for most oils, are completely safe to put on your body. Uh, there should be no risk involved. You just you just have to use a lot less and they both get into your skin the same way. So it's all good. Um, we're, we definitely watch out for it. We, we go by the book. This is this is made by the company. They know what they're talking about. So we we make sure and and do everything that we can to make the students feel safe and make the class the best that we can. So I'm gonna be teaching this class. Kristen is going to be adjusting and helping out because we do have quite a few people and that's a lot of that's a lot of hands I gotta touch. Um, so we do need a little bit of help and it's gonna be a really, really great class. So if you can sign up, it is at mojofitstudios.com. Click on schedule and you do get a free week. So if it's your first time, go ahead and sign up and it's absolutely free and you can take seven days in a row um, of classes. This one should be really fun. Um, you'll meet a lot of fun, friendly faces. And yeah, we've done it a couple months already and I'm excited to bring it for the third month for December. So happy holidays and if I don't see you, have a very Merry Christmas. Bye.